Exhibitions has reopened for the summer. The James Hogg exhibition at the head of the Ettrick Valley pays tribute to the writer and his work. Perhaps best known for the private memoirs and confessions of a justified sinner, self-taught Hogg is regarded as hugely influential on novelists and poets who came after him. The Duke of Buccleuch, who officially opened the exhibition on Sunday, believes the old school is a fitting venue for honouring the Ettrick Shepherd. It's wonderful to be up at the head of the Ettrick Valley and this is the heartland for James Hogg who's buried a few hundred yards away and here we are celebrating one of Scotland's great literary figures who um, is um, uh, commemorated in a brilliant exhibition here in the old Ettrick School um, and, and for me it, it's a joy to be here because my family was deeply involved with Hogg, they provided him with um, a land, a farm at Old Treve and Eldon hope on, on which to make his living he wasn't a very good farmer to be honest but um, that's by the by but he was an extraordinary man of letters he was a poet songwriter novelist essayist journalist and um, sadly because of covid the uh, 250th anniversary of his birth couldn't be properly celebrated so we sure are celebrating now and i think it's enormously important that we recognize one of scotland's great writers and sport now in athletics, Priorsford Primary School made it onto the podium at the Scottish Primary School's Relay Championships at the weekend. The boys' team finished second, while the girls' team were just run out of the medals, finishing fifth in the final. Now for a look at what the Borders weather has in store for us, here's Judith Rolston. Good afternoon. Dry with some sunshine to end the day on, leading to a dry start to the night with clear spells. During the early hours, cloud will increase with outbreaks of rain pushing up from the southwest on approach to dawn. Wednesday light with lows of 8 Celsius. A cloudy start to tomorrow with outbreaks of rain first thing, but the rain will clear away to the north with brighter conditions following on, coupled with one or two afternoon showers, highs of 16 degrees. And that's BBC Radio. Radio Scotland's weather for the borders. That doesn't sound too bad at all. I'll be back with more news and sport for the borders at half past five.